gave my best to you Nothing for me to do But I've one last cry One last cry Before I leave it all behind I gotta put you out of my mind This time Stop living a lie I guess
hear it and the phone rings Do you wish it was me calling you? Do you still feel the same? Or has time put out the flame? Be the one to catch your fall. 
Yeah. Uh, so tonight we can walk her around. Just turn around. Just turn around. I want to do this. <laughs> I want everybody to see you. Yeah, you get her. You want me to let her go, right? Huh? You got to let her go. Okay, because we should go here. It's on Facebook. Yeah, you can't go. So let her go to do the camera. Yeah. 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 Let's go to back over here. Now, are you comfortable with this? The mic is hot. Well, I guess it turned it off. But, but what I got, when I'm finished, I was going to say um, the bride and groom um, desire to share their vows with each other. I'm going to keep my mask on um, because you guys are going to have yours off. Yeah. Oh, okay. And That's then I'm going to just do the mic that way. And then I'll just grab it and say uh -huh. it. Okay. Now let's see. Let's see how far if you come up under here. Because I want to still talk on this one too. Yeah. Because I want everybody to hear you. Okay. That way, since they got the drape, um, I don't want to like own her hair and and your hair, because both of you are tall. So I'll just have the mic like that. And until then, I'll, I'll do this. Sounds good, sir.
Greetings. I want to take the opportunity to welcome you uh, to the wedding ceremony of Jerome Garrison Jr. and Sydney Clark. Today, they enter into this celebration with two different last names. But at the end of the ceremony, they will leave and depart this ground with the same last name. Let's just give them a praise clap for this big step in their lives. <laughs> Dearly beloved, we're gathered together here in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join this man and this woman together in holy matrimony, which is an honorable estate instituted by God, signifying unto us the mystical union that exists between Christ and the church. Which holy estate these two persons now come to be joined? I require and charge you both as you stand in the presence of God to remember that love and love alone as it avails will help you to establish a solid foundation for a happy home. Jerome, Wilt thou have this woman to be thy wedded wife, to live together in the ordinance of holy estate of matrimony? Wilt thou serve her, love her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others? Keep thee only unto her so long 
as you both shall live, say, I will. I will. Sydney, wilt thou have this man to be thy wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinance, in the holy state of matrimony? Wilt thou serve him, love him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, forsaking all others? Keep thee only unto him, so long as you both shall live. Respond by saying, I will. I will. Who giveth this woman to be married to this man? Hazel Peters and John Clark. Let's go into prayer. Father God in heaven, we come on this special occasion to unite together two loyal hearts in endless love. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that their hearts found a way to connect with each other. And for that, our souls are satisfied. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that two families are now going to be joined together uh, through this marriage of Jerome and Sydney. We pray, Father, the best for their lives. We pray, Heavenly Father, that whatever mountains they face, they will face them together. Whatever valleys they must channel through, they will channel through them together. Whatever rivers they must cross, they will swim through them together. Always encouraging and lifting each other up. The good times, the bad times, the troubled times, the times that we have misunderstandings. I pray, Heavenly Father, that you put into them and birth in them the spirit of unity as you hold them together as only you can. In your precious name we pray. Amen. Amen. Share together our Old Testament scripture. Proverbs chapter 3, verse 5 and 6. Trust in the Lord with all of your heart. Lean not into your own understanding. And all thy ways acknowledge him. And he will direct your path. We share now with you scripture reading from 1 Corinthians chapter 13. We will be highlighting verse 11 to verse 13. When I was a child, I talked like a child. I thought like a child. I reasoned like a child. When I became a man, I put away childhood behind me. For now we see only a reflection as in a mirror. Then we shall see face to face. Now I know in part then I shall know fully, even as I am fully known. Now, these three things remain. Faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these, the greatest of these, the greatest of these is love. Jerome and Sydney have a de desire to share uh, their vows with each other. Uh, and as they share their vows, uh, we will be prepared then to receive and bless the rain. Jerome. <laughs> 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 
Sydney Clark, I love you with all of my heart. I decided to use your new initials for my vowels, SCG. The S is for sweet, your sweet spirit that captivated me, <laughs> that didn't let me play games and try to figure out life anymore. I knew what I wanted. I knew what I wanted when I met your sweet spirit. I knew what I wanted to be. I knew the man I wanted to be. The C is for Christ, for your relationship with him, how you put him first. No matter what, I admire you for that. The G is for God, just his abundant mercy, his abundant grace on our life. And I vowed to just continue to let him lead me in our relationship and go to him for everything that I need and continue to give you everything that I have and I love you so much. Jerome Kern, Garrison Jr. It's clear that you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. Your life is a living and walking testimony of God's love, his graciousness, his mercy, and his every single day you walk in Christ's light. You're God's son and I just love you so much and I thank you for leading in our relationship. When I thought about writing these vows, I thought about the word different. We're different, babe, and that's okay. <laughs> we lead different, we love different, we serve different, and that's okay, that's not what the world always looks like, but I hope that we can be a model for what God wants for a husband and wife, and that we can pursue what he has for us and the calling on our lives, and that I can support you. As a wife today, I vow to support all of your dreams, be there right there with you, not question you one step of the way. And that's because you've loved me unconditionally. And today I just want to say to everyone here that Jerome is the true testament of a real man and a gentleman. All those late nights that you drive me home and follow me home just to make sure I'm okay. everything and the way that you respect my mind, body, and soul, everything about me. And I just love you and I'm so glad to be your wife and I'm so happy to have forever with you. I love you. That's going to be hard to beat. <laughs> oh, eternal God, as we pray together, preserve of all mankind, giver of all spiritual gift, bless us with your everlasting life. Send thy blessing upon these servants, this man and this woman, whom we bless in your name, that they may so live together as husband and and wife, and that Heavenly Father, you will bless their union to be in perfect peace. We realize, Lord, that there are moments that life has a way of shaking us down from head to toe. But I pray, Lord, that each time life challenges us, that this couple will rebound back, stand back up on their feet, and give you the glory. In your name we pray. Amen. The wedding ring. The wedding ring is an outward sign of two loyal hearts being joined together. I share now. Sydney's reign with Jerome. She placed it upon her finger, the third finger, in her left hand, repeating after me in token, in token, in token, in pledge. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
in pledge. The vow. The vow. Between us made. Between us made. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wear. I thee wear. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. Sydney, I take the honor of sharing with you Jerome's ring. When you place it up on his left hand, third finger, repeating after me in token. In, in token. token. And yes. pledge. <laughs> in pledge. Of the vow. Of the vow. Between us made. Between us made. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. We will now have the lighting of the unity candle and the godparents here. Okay, then we'll do it. Okay, we'll do it. Jerome and Sydney are lighting the unity candle. The unity candle represents uh, the two families, the two sides of the family. And as they light the center candle, uh, together is symbolic of, of these families that are together and the unity that they share share together. Uh, right now, because of inclement, inclement wind, uh, we're having some challenges, uh, but we're going to pray the Spirit in those candles, because we're not going to let that light it be extinguished in your life. We good. <laughs> we good. Just some candles. To God be the glory. Amen. Brother Jerome says, just a candle. <laughs> uh, and the candle, candle, again, is symbolic of the two families that are being joined together. Uh, and so now your family has been extended. Amen. And both require love, both still require patience, mm -hmm. uh, going to require some attention. Amen. <laughs> and so uh, you got to work together as a team uh, to make it work. All right. To God be the glory. Well, those whom God have joined together. Let no man, no woman, no in-laws, no outlaws put asunder. God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, bless and preserve and keep you the Lord mercifully with his favor look upon you and so fill you with love and spiritual benediction and grace that ye may so live together in this life that in the world to come, you may have life everlasting. You may salute the bride. This thing blowing all over the place. Oh, share with you now the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, 
but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and forever. Amen. 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 Let all the friends and family respond by saying amen. Amen. <laughs> amen. We close with this prayer. Almighty God, who at the beginning did create our first parents, Adam and Eve, and did sanctify and join them together in marriage, pour upon your riches of grace, sanctify and bless you, that you may praise him both in body and in soul and live together in holy love until your love ends. Amen. It is my honor to present and introduce for the very first time the new Mr. and Mrs. One last name, <laughs> Jerome Garrison and Sydney Garrison. This concludes our ceremony, and I believe that uh, they're going to invite everyone back. Uh, I don't see Jennifer. I think they're going back to the clubhouse. All right, we're back. So what happened was I was faking around with her about the bees. And there was a and real bee there was, attack. There was a real bee attack. So, we almost lost Sydney today. Yes. We but, um, lost this is why, you know, this is why I stay down in Phoenix, babe. That's why they don't go out here. But you always want to go up to the hills and no, stuff. No, you always want to go to the hills. I said, let's drive. You're like, let's get out. Go to the lake. They're going to check out the monster house. Anyway, we're having a great time, everybody. Give me a kiss, baby. I love you. A smile for the people. I love you, beans. Love oh. you too, chocolate drop. I love beans with chocolate drop. Forever. You gonna get up here a mountain up here and with the mountain lions? See, you already know what's up. You already know what's up. Ooh. So we are here looking at the beauty of the world. Okay, all that. Yeah, I stepped on it. I'm sorry. She gonna ask me, do I think Earth is just Earth? I'm not sure what else Earth is supposed to be other than Earth. Go ahead and explain what you're trying to say. I'm talking about like there's more life out there than just Earth. Right? So is Earth just Earth? This wasn't supposed to go.
Hey everyone, it's uh, Jerome and Sydney. <laughs> Garrison. Garrison now. Uh, we just wanted to come to the live stream and just say thank you. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, we have friends and family. Uh, we know a lot of you wish you could have been here. We, we wish you could have been here. Obviously because of circumstances it didn't allow, but we just wanted to make sure that we said thank you. Yes, thank you. And I just thank God that you guys can all be a part of our day, even though it's different. Um, but, you know, we still made it happen. And we're just so thankful for your support and your love and so excited to be husband and wife. We're so excited to be husband and wife. <laughs> Uh, no, I just want to just really make sure that we came over here. Yeah. Um, and we want to thank Gabe Klein, uh, who you can't see right now, but he's behind the live stream. I want to thank him. He's actually helping us out and uh, just really been working with us amazingly. So we want to thank him for that. Obviously, our friends and family, uh, our parents <laughs> yes. who supported us. Um, and just we love you guys. And remember, keep God first. Yes. Keep, keep God, God first. first. Yeah. Yes. So we love you all. Have a great night. Thank you for tuning night. in.